Hey guys, this is your friend just Adi and today I'm going to show you my OBS stream settings for you guys because most of you guys asked what are your stream settings so I'm going to show it to you and my PC config is i3 6100 and GTX 750 Ti. This video uh, I'm making in English because this video has a global appeal and many users use GTX 750 Ti as well as i3 6100 and they are finding it difficult to stream. So without further ado, let's get started. Okay guys, so first you wanna do is, what, what you wanna do is, open your OBS setting, then go to settings tab. I mean in general you don't wanna change anything, if you don't like the default white theme, you can change it to dark. But I prefer white uh, white theme, then go to stream, I, I think you know all this, but if you don't know, you wanna stream on YouTube, uh, stream type is equal to stream services, set service YouTube gaming, you can also use Twitch if you want, if you want to uh, stream on Twitch, but I specifically stream on YouTube, so I'll choose YouTube and YouTube stream streaming. Then server so primary YouTube is so in the server now. The stream key, uh, you can get the stream key on your account. Just go log into your account, click on the icon, uh, uh, create a studio, and then this will bring it bring you to the uh, this window and click on live stream and stream now. Then if you scroll down down here, you can find this encoder setup. Here is the stream key, then reveal it and then copy it entirely and uh, paste it over here and save the settings i'm not going to show the stream key because it's not safe and please do not share your stream key with anyone because uh, if someone has your stream key you can definitely stream any uh, you know explicit material on your uh, youtube on your youtube channel and you can get banned for not doing anything then on this type youtube here is what the magic happens then there are two, two modes in uh, output mode simple and advanced uh, if you know what you're doing in, on the OBS, I'll definitely suggest ki use uh, advanced mode, but for me simple just works out. So now let's get into the streaming settings, the video bitrate. The video bitrate is the amount of rate you are sending the video encoded video to the server. So for me 5 Mbps, 500 uh, Mbps works out because I have a pretty stable and good internet so I use 500 Mbps. But if you have, if you have a very slow internet like 3 Mbps something like that, you can use 2500 like video bitrate it, it will definitely work out even though your stream quality will uh, reduce but uh, it will still stream very uh, pretty stable without laggy or you know stuttering uh, performance just uh, i said uh, just set it to 5000 because it uh, 5000 works for me then in encoder setup uh, click on encoder if you have any other uh, graphic card other than nvidia you have to set it to software x26 uh, x264 sorry uh, hardware NVNC is used when you have a GTX 750 Ti or any NVIDIA card. So basically, uh, this video is specifically uh, made for GTX 750 Ti and uh, i3 6100. So I'm gonna choose hardware NVNC and you should also choose this. Now audio bitrate, the audio quality I suggest just keep it on 160 because any other value other than 160 or uh, above 160 doesn't, I mean uh, that doesn't make any changes guys, you know, and 160 is pretty stable. Now if, if this box is unchecked guys, just check the enable advanced encoder settings, uh, this box and then this will pop up, these two settings. The encoder preset, you have to set it to default. But if you if you are experiencing uh, a stutter or lag in your stream, you can definitely uh, uh, set it to high performance quality. But if you don't have, uh, you have, if you are not getting the quality of the stream, you can set it to high quality. But for me default works out, but I suggest if you are using low but like it like 25 2500 or something like that you can use it to high quality uh, you can set it to high quality because it will uh, enhance the quality of your stream but mind you guys it will have some performance effect on your in game uh, have performance effect on your game which you're playing so uh, i mean how how much performance if, uh, effect it will uh, take i don't know uh, almost 20 or 15 fps i guess now this is it for the streaming part for recording uh, part you, uh, the recording quality should be set to uh, same as stream and recording part it's up to you what you wanna uh, do with the recordings where you wanna save it now go to audio uh, sample rate should be at 48 kilohertz channel should be stereo desktop audio should be set to default i don't have any desktop audio device too so i'm so disabling this and the mic should be set to uh, and uh, set to the mic which you are using in my case i'm using the mic of my headphones so i'm going to choose this microphone high definition audio device then come to this video tab now here it's an important part okay 
even though you have uh, even though your base resolution is 1080p it's going to uh, stream at 720p so uh, now common fps value i'll come to the downscale factor the common fps value should be set to 60 or 30 depending on the game which you're playing if you're streaming counter strike global offensive like me i'll definitely suggest go to 60 Uh, and any other game like Rise uh, of Tomb Raider or uh, Battlefield One, you can set it to 30 FPS. Downscale filter. Now, guys, this is this is one important part. I'll definitely say just go with blank cross. But even after doing all the things uh, in this tab, uh, this tab output, uh, if your if your stream is lagging, I'll definitely suggest go to the bicubic. uh by cubic uh, option because this will uh, somehow you know reduce the quality of a stream maintaining it at the decent quality but for me lang cross just works out guys because uh, it gives you the best quality of stream and i'll suggest the lang cross uh, sharpening scaling 30 to samples because it is the best option which is available guys so guys this is it for the video if you like this video please give it a thumbs up share this video and subscribe to my youtube gaming channel i stream every day at indian time 8 pm or 8:30 pm you can definitely join me at the stream so guys i'll meet you in another video or another stream